Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So on my lips today, I'm wearing a combination of this purple playtime soft matte lip crayon in 20 questions time four. And never have I ever time three. I first applied this and then I applied this on top of that and it gives you this very nice nude. I feel like if you just like increase uh, the intensity of each thing, you can match it to your skin tone and make like a very nice pinkish nude and I absolutely love it because it stays on your lips for a very long time. So in today's video, I'm going to show you the laziest, absolutely the laziest way and the easiest way you can get rid of acne scars and any kind of old scars and dark spots and um, it doesn't get easier than this. So this is like the easiest thing you can do and you don't have to be consistent, you can do whenever you have the time for it. I have this one scar here. I think you can see it. I'm trying to get rid of that. So yeah, it's like the most easiest thing. And if you can't do this also, then that means you are very, very lazy and I can't help you after that. But you know, that's not true. I'm still going to help you. So yeah, do this and uh, you should see results quickly. And the ingredients are very, very easy. So the first ingredient you will need is Kasturi Manjal. Now I know I use this a lot because it is amazing as an ingredient. It is excellent for your skin. It has a lot of benefits. I don't know which brand this is, but this was gifted to me by a friend because Miriam James is that easy. Like let's just go out and buy Kasturi Manjal for her and she'll be really happy and I am. So this is just like 150 rupees. I'm not sure. I think this was from Kerala. I'm not sure but Kasturi Manjal is amazing and I know a lot of people are allergic to this and uh, this also can irritate your skin because it is a little uh, it gives you that tingling sensation so if you are allergic to this you can simply skip this and use honey instead but if you can get your hands on this please try it it's an amazing ingredient so all you're going to do is you're going to take a small piece of potato Again, please don't waste these uh, ingredients and you're going to take a fork and you're just going to score the potato like this just to get the juices out like this. It's like the easiest way to do it. I mean, you can like grind it and use the pulp and all of that, but nobody has that much time anyways, or I think you have the time. So if you have it, just do that. But I find this the easiest and especially when you're feeling lazy, like this really helps you. So once you do that, you're just going to take a little bit of the Kasturi Manjal. Very, very little because Kasturi Manjal can stay in your skin and you're just going to apply it on top like this. And once you've applied it on top like this, you're just going to use it on your face. And that's it. You just have to let this dry on your face before you wash it off. Now, if you have cut the potato like I have, then please do not throw it. Keep this in the fridge. The next time you use it, just cut off a thin slice from the top and you can reuse it so that you don't waste potato as well. I don't want any of y'all to be homeless because of wasting potatoes. So you will let this dry on your skin and then I will tell you what else to do. But let it completely dry no matter what skin type you have oily sensitive dry you can still use this and this will benefit your skin really well now once you've washed off your face no matter what remedy you do no matter what mask you use always make sure to use some kind of moisturizer or any cream that you use after that because it's very important for you to give your skin back the moisture even if you use a moisturizing uh mask so always moisturize
So another amazing thing about this remedy is that you can use this anywhere. If you have dark neck, you can use this. You can use this on your elbows, on your knees. You can use this in your inner thigh if you have darkness over there because of uh, rubbing of your skin. This is very, very mild, but also very effective. So you can use this on your intimate areas as well. Make sure uh, whenever you use this, you do it before your shower and you leave it on and then wash it off. So you can use this anywhere. You can use this on your back, on your butt, wherever you feel like you can use this on your hands and on your feet. But always make sure that whatever you do, you always moisturize your skin after that. So I hope you guys like today's video. Please try this remedy. It is like the laziest and easiest way you can uh, get this really amazing skin. You can even out your skin tone and get rid of scars and uh, dark spots. It's like really easy. Please do it and you will love the results. Stay consistent because this is so like simple and so natural that you can use it every day whenever you wish to use it. Whenever you have the time, use it and you will absolutely love how this will make your skin look, especially if you have any kind of acne scars or any kind of uh, dark spots even if you have ac active acne you can use this this does not irritate your skin at all but like i said if you are allergic to kasturi manjal then just simply add honey on top of that and use it if this video helped you guys then please like and subscribe until next time bye